Meg Cattell, and I'm a cinematographer. We wanted to show a little bit of a slice of life of this great family here in Colorado that has a very traditional sort of small family farm. I was really excited to try the dual ISO. Um, I haven't shot at 4,000 and in the dock space, sometimes you get into a very low light situation. That ability is, I think, a total game changer. I think the combination of the 4,000 ISO with the Auto ND saves your image. For time lapse, it's invaluable. I would not want to do it any other way. We had some specialty shots where, you know, a focus puller would just be guessing of where to put the focus, because if we have five chickens flying out of a coop, and we don't know which one's gonna be first, and which one's gonna be fastest, and which one's gonna look the best, and which one I'm gonna frame up on. It worked really well for that kind of stuff. My name is Rob Scrivener, and I'm a cinematographer. I do a lot of documentary work and also commercial work. My role on this production was to shoot the behind the scenes. So it's a, a doc within a doc. So this is one of my first shoots using a full frame. The depth of field in the full frame was really, really, really nice. It's nice and soft all the way through. Like I went into no man's land and was shooting at uh, 1.4. It had more room to breathe in the shallow depth of field and I really liked that a lot. I really enjoyed using the new S709 LUT. This one seems like it's much closer to a, a Venice look. The skin tones look really, really, really nice. The, the roll off on the highlights, I was really happy with. It made me more confident on what the final image is gonna look like. The lens I used the most was the, the 16 to 35. It's just such a sharp image. The autofocus on it is insane. To have this direct access point to speak to the engineers, we're gonna go back and make tweaks and and improve things and do add to the next model. Wanting to write down and take notes of what we liked and didn't like and the features that we found really useful. Lucky to be able to have this experience. I like the functionality of the body. They made changes to the buttons and the layouts and things like that. Love it a lot. The way it fits on my shoulder when it's completely stripped down is much more comfortable. I will absolutely use the FX9. everything that I wanted to see. I'm definitely a convert to the FX9. 